my name is Suba Garwal and I'm a math expert. And today we're going to go over some sort of paper folding activities in math. And the great thing about paper folding is it gives you a three-dimensional object which is great for geometry. So say we used origami. And one of the things we created with origami was a square, or a cube rather. I'm going to draw a picture of this cube for you guys right now. And this can help kids understand the concept of what a polyhedron is, which is a three-dimensional object made up of surfaces and edges. Flat surfaces, that is. And so if they have that in front of them and they can feel it, it's going to help them visualize it better. You can go over the different parts, like this right here. These straight lines are edges. The corners right here are going to be vertices. The flat surfaces are going to be faces. Just kind of having a physical object to pair with the written definitions is going to help them remember and understand that better. And you can also go over different properties of objects, like for instance, a square right here. You can count it out how many vertices it has. It has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight vertices. And you can kind of make different shapes, help them learn, help them understand, and that's a paper folding activity in math. My name is Subra Gerwal and thank you for taking an interest in mathematics.